Exercise 19. At the airport. Tara is going to visit her friend in Germany. To get there from England, she has to take a flight in an aeroplane. So now she is at the airport. The first thing she did when she got there was to leave her car at the long-term car park. This is a special car park where travelers can leave their cars for over a week. Now she has gone to the part of the airport where she will start her flight. This is the passenger terminal. The part of the terminal she is looking for is called departures. The other part of the terminal is arrivals and this deals with travellers whose flight has just brought them to the airport. Once she gets to departures, Tara takes a quick look at the flight announcements. Good, her flight is still on time and there are no delays. Because she wants to have plenty of time before her flight, Tara goes straight to the check-in desk. She is very early, so there is no queue. At the desk, she shows the ticket for her flight and hands over her suitcase. The baggage allowance for her flight is just 25 kilograms, so Tara has been careful not to pack too much. If her suitcase were too heavy, Tara would have to pay an excess baggage fee. Now, her suitcase is taken away to be carried in the plane's cargo. Tara has marked a big cross on her suitcase, so she will be able to recognize it easily when it arrives on the luggage carousel for her to collect at Munich Airport. After she has checked in, Tara is given a boarding pass, which will allow her onto the aeroplane. Now, Tara has to go through security and immigration. She checks the regulations and makes sure she has no dangerous objects, such as liquid or aerosols, in the bag which she will be taking onto the aeroplane as carry-on baggage. She also checks again that she has her passport to show at immigration. Once she has gone through security, she passes through a scanner to make sure she has no metal objects in her pockets. Her bag goes through a special x-ray machine, which checks that too. Now she is in the flight side part of the airport. If there is anything she has forgotten on the public side, it is too late now. But Tara thinks she has remembered everything. She checks her boarding pass to see at what gate she should find her plane. Because her gate is on the other side of the airport, she has to take a shuttle train. Fortunately, it is not crowded. Tara knows that she might have to wait for a while in the departure lounge next to the gate before she boards the aeroplane. So she decides to have something to drink while she is waiting. Then, when she hears the announcement that her flight is boarding, she hands in her boarding pass to the flight attendant and walks down the runway where her plane is waiting. Have a good flight, Tara. If you want to do some exercises on the vocabulary you have just learned, you can find these on the English for Everybody website, along with this and other videos at this address.